Angelique Hill's been burning the night She's learned to fly with just instruments in sight Through clouds and storms she'll steer with skill She's mastered the art, she's got the will Tail dragger wheels, she's got the knack On gravel, on grass, no holding back No runways too rough, no storm too tall Angelique Hill, Sir, All right, then. Cheryl, mate, Yorkie here. Welcome you back to some more of Yorkie's Choice with Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024 and Angelique Hill's career progression. Today we're going to try and get a couple of certifications. If you heard the little intro music, uh, then you know that we're going to be going for tailwheel and instruments. Try the tail wheel first. Six minutes allows you to fly tail draggers. Let's see. How do we get in there? Oh, take exam. There it is. See how bad it goes. Taking off, landing, and taxiing in a plane uh, equipped with a tail wheel is not as easy as it might seem. I haven't exactly found landing all that easy to begin with, honestly. Not with a mouse and keyboard. Airplanes with main gear toward the front of the aircraft and a small wheel underneath the tail are commonly referred to as co conventionally geared aircraft or tail draggers. You will be showing what you can do aboard one of the most advanced conventionally geared aircraft on the market, the Cub Crafters x -Cub. See what happens. See if I'll ask Angelique can do this <laughs> with me in control. Yeah, she'd be able to if it was someone decent in control. Auto rod resistance is turned off. Okay. That's that. Pitot cover. It's also the static fault on these things. Chocks away. And then we can get in. As covered in our briefing, we'll be performing a standard traffic pattern around Miami's KLNA airport with the Cub Crafters X Cub. Remember that tail triggers do not behave in the same way as tricycle geared aircraft while taxiing, taking off, and landing. Try to maintain center line and anticipate rear wheel drift while turning on the taxiway. Keep your speed low while taxiing and brake progressively while pitching back once you land to avoid flipping the aircraft over. Now to taxi. Remember Take off Lima brakes. November, Alpha, on traffic cup craft you will want to lift the tail of the Tango aircraft Lima by Romeo gently Alpha pushing forward on to the runway one zero. Once you are on the main gear and reach rotation speed, start gently pitching back to take off. Keep your feet on the rudder to brace for left turning tendencies. Oh, that moved a lot quicker. Whoa! Okay! Yeah, that's, that, that's definitely a lot... Uh, A lot sharper on the turn there. <laughs> Keep it to a nice steady rate, because this is going to be tricky, I get a feeling. Doing donuts there. It lined up a little bit. There we go. Nope, turning. There we go. 12 knots. Steered away from the grass a little. There we go. 
Nope, there. Take the throttle out, I don't think we need it on this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Go real gentle on this thing. Hold short. Now to take off. Kilo Lima November Alpha traffic Cupcraft is golf. Tango Lima Romeo Alpha taking off runway one zero departure to the west. Which way are we taking off then? Well, we're heading for runway ten anyway. Looks like we're heading that way. Just put a little bit more throttle on, not much. Uh, okay, we're off. I had the wrong turn there. But we're... Max throttle. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa! Well, we got up. <laughs> that was that was definitely something. On to crosswind leg when we get there. Just turn into it. The plane's obviously a lot slower than the Cessna. Come on, need to go up. There we are. A decent bank angle, mind you. Downwind leg. Gone out of the thousand, unfortunately. Take the uh, throttle down, I think. That'll get us back down where we need to be. Yeah. Announce position. Kilo Lima November Alpha traffic Cupcraft is golf. Tango Lima Romeo Alpha one miles north, one thousand one hundred feet inbound to land runway two eight. Downwind end right here. Going down a little, so we'll take the throttle out some. Base end. Try to land by making contact with all three wheels at the same time. Ah, good luck with that one. Whoa, 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 that's not what I did, that's not what I did, that's... Pull up, pull up! Kilo Lima November Alpha traffic Cupcraft is golf. Tango Lima Romeo Alpha is on final runway 2A to land. That, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's gonna hit, that's... You should not... 
attempt a landing here. Take off again and land on the designated runway. <laughs> okay. Um, I was going to you not have landed here. You have failed the certification. I was not going to include this epic fail. Just <laughs> redo it, and I'm going to redo it, obviously. But the hilarity of telling him I'm not meant to land in someone's living room, I'm going to include that one. Okay, try again. That pizza when uh, static chocks away. Get in the plane, start the engine. As covered in our briefing, we'll be performing a standard traffic pattern around Miami's KLNA airport with the Cub Crafters X Cub. Remember that tail triggers do not behave in the same way as tricycle geared aircraft while taxiing, taking off and landing. Try to maintain center line and anticipate rear will drift while turning on the taxiway. Keep your speed low while taxiing and brake progressively while pitching back once you land to avoid flipping the aircraft over. Announce and release. Get some Kilo Lima November Alpha traffic you want to lift the tail of the aircraft by Tango Lima Romeo Alpha is taxiing to runway one zero. Once you are on the main gear, and reach rotation speed, start gently pitching back to take off. Keep your feet on the rudder to brace for left turning tendencies. Off we go. At least we didn't do a donut this time. Turn it back a little. That should be about straight. Ten knots there. Nine should be quite fast enough for this thing stop shot announce takeoff Kilo Lima November Alpha traffic Cubcraft is Golf. Tango Lima Romeo Alpha taking off runway 10 departure to the west. Head for the runway. Don't want to go too fast as we approach the runway. We're up. We're up. 
bit smoother this time. Still need a lot of practice, but a bit smoother. Don't like doing this from inside because I can't see anything there. Crosswind and I can go to a thousand. Rapidly approaching a thousand, so slow down the ascent. Yeah. Downwind to a thousand. Losing some altitude here. We'll get up, don't you worry. There we are, regaining again. Don't want to climb too steep though. And we are right now climbing a bit steeper than I'd like. Calling for a high 1300 to 1000, have it? Sounds good to me. Announce position. Kilo Lima November Alpha Traffic Hub Craft is Golf. Tango Lima Romeo Alpha 1 miles north 1200 feet inbound to land runway 28. take a lot of the throttle out because I don't think we need it. Looks like this thing stays a lot early, uh, up just by itself almost with not much effort. Try to land by making contact with all three wheels at the same time. Kilo Lima November Alpha traffic Cubcraft is golf. Tango Lima Romeo Alpha is on final runway 2A to land. I'm not on the runway. Oh no, there it is. That is the runway. Try and take it down. Well, we landed. Kinda. Didn't want to go that high. Come on. Take the gas out. Right, let's let's just have a bit of throttle. Oh, come on. How come you're doing a lot better at moving before and now you're not? Whoa, 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 turn! Turn? Why are you turning the other way? The hell? 
I have full rudder the other way and you turn it you're turning wrong. Come on, pick it up. Alright. We're getting there. I don't know if this will count as a success or not, but if it does, that's fine with me. I'll get that van off the uh, off the uh, taxiway, please. Whoa, 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 whoa! Come on! Kilo Lima November Alpha Traffic Cup Crafters Golf. Tango Lima Romeo Alpha is taxiing to parking. Yeah, I should be. It's literally steering against what I'm doing. This is weird. I mean, let's take the flaps out for one thing. Right. It is not following what the rudder's doing at all. Now it is. Let's see if this gets us where we need to be. No, not that fast. I mean, we're down. That's weird. What is it wanting me to do now? What is it wanting me to do? I mean, it says land on runway, but the arrows aren't pointing to a bloody runway. Should I drive over to the runway? Will that count? odd and very confusing I am not in the least bit sure what's happening here I mean we're heading to the wrong way is that what we need to do? Now we can stop the aircraft. None of my students performed a belly landing before. You've passed your certification. Congratulations. How? A few minor kinks to iron out. And a few minor kinks? Pilot. Is that what we're calling it? 84%! <laughs> Ha ha ha!
<laughs> okay, that's hilarious. Spec the traffic pattern altitude. Spec the traffic pattern path. Respect the taxi path. I'm not sure you can say I did that at the end. Plane handling. Okay, well, we got the certificate. That has to be the most bizarre end I've ever seen to one of these things. Alright. I'll be back later this afternoon to do the uh, the instrument flight rating. No, inst sorry, instrument rating. Allows you to navigate when you cannot fly using visual references. You'll no longer be ground by rainy, cloudy, snowy or poor visibility. Right, I will see you for that. Well, I just had to take that uh, tailwheel endorsement again because for some reason the game bugged out and wouldn't register it. Even though it told me I passed. Not a problem, got it now. Anyway, next thing up is going to be instrument rating. Let's get in there. Overview, once the weather turns bad enough for visual flight rules to no longer apply, pilots must rely on their instrument rating or IR to fl for them to fly. <clears throat> Obtaining an instrument flight rules rating is invaluable to pilots that aspire to do more than fly general aviation aircraft in clear conditions. Show what you've learned by performing an approach and landing at Sunberg Airport and the Scottish Shetland Isles. See what we can do. Right, let's see I know if we can get this, this can look daunting, instrument but you'll certification. You'll be able to perform your approach by relying on your aircraft's instruments, just like you did in your training. Okay. Flight to EVT. Well, first thing I want to do is get close. Romeo Alpha acknowledge and turn the... Turn the thing up. Cessna Lima Romeo Alpha acknowledge last transmission. I would if it would let me, but it's not letting me. I actually think I need to be over this way because the green line there is the direction that I need to go. Uh, I need to be pointing in the end. But the break in it shows that I'm not on the line I need to be on. Bring the power down some. Turn that way. Let's get to twenty one hundred feet. Probably gonna put me down in the clouds, is that? Too far, too far. degrees the other way, I don't want to do that. We're back online too fast. Nope, too far, too far. Don't, don't tilt, don't tilt. I got to 2100, I can pick it up a little bit now.
below 2100, we're hoping to go any lower. Just hoping to get that green line lined up. into a cloud bank. Alright, that's 2100. Alright, we're scraping the hell out of the engine here. Still trying to get the green line lined up. We have dropped a long way below 2100, I need to get up. Raising. Don't need to raise much more than that. Switch back to visual flight rules before landing. Identifying the runway lights should help you during the transition. So we're trying to fly to Sandberg. Glow in the 2100. Maybe we don't have to stay above, uh, stay at that. I think that purple line might be what we're aiming for, and the dot is us. So we're moving over towards it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't drop that low. What plane are we in, I wonder? So this seems a different layout to the Cessna 172, which is what I thought we were in. Ah, the line's starting to move, I think. Happy to rise, because we're down at 1200. Yeah, the line's moving. Let's get back online. Let's get back in the, in the zone here. Need to go a bit the other way now. Yeah, we've gone above the purple line, you see. Whoa! 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 Splash down! <laughs> I was so focused on getting on the purple line, I went, I went completely wrong with it, with the uh, altitude. Now we need to get back to it. Don't! Don't! Hey! 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 Don't dive! Don't dive!
get over that way. Keep turning a little. getting closer I see we're almost back on the purple line and I see that seems to be the runway down there not sure just how far away we are I expect the green arrow to start lining up. Oh, I think we've overshot the runway here. We've definitely overshot the runway. Yeah, we're gonna have to do a go around. That's okay. We made it to the runway. Now we need a bit of a go around. cloud in this zone. Back over the land. to see and then we can come back in. Right, now we can come back in. Nothing wrong with the go around. It's better than a crash. Where am I going? Am I going the wrong way entirely? I think I might be. Yeah, I'm going the opposite way. I just realised the other's pointing the opposite way. Alright. I mean, as long as I can pass, that's okay.
I was trying to go. The, yeah, I was trying to go away from the arrow. Um, I didn't know what, notice the arrow was pointing the opposite direction. That was entirely my fault. It was a lack of awareness. We're just over the water, so let's get up a little bit. Turn in. I believe zero degrees is north, so we should be heading about due north now. Until the line is up, uh, gets towards the line. I want to get close to the line before I turn towards the uh, turn towards the west. Although I am going uh, more than north, uh, more starting to go more east than north, so I don't want to do that. Now we're getting onto it. Overshot slightly. Ooh. That's good, that's good. That looks like the runway ahead. Is it? Yep. this whoa 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 as whoa. long as I can land I don't care too much if it's not exactly on the wrong way as long as I can land we are on the runway and we did it reduce speed Reduce speed, knocking the speed off, good. Stop at hold short. We're at 31 knots, that's too fast for taxiing. Bring that right down. On below 20 knots, I believe, for taxiing. There we are. Lots of uh, actually did get lined up right. I'm going to need a lot of practice, but I could get the certification, I think. And certainly it was a smooth landing, or relatively smooth. Certainly better than most I've done. So I've got to give myself that as uh, props for getting there slowly. It is not easy with mouse and keyboard. I did try on the Xbox with the controller. I could I was right. I couldn't bloody control that thing at all. It was a nightmare. Twelve knots, that's plenty fast enough. Stop over there at the hold shot. Just take the engine out and run in.
done. Let's not let me announce the taxes, let's just shortcut. Control Shift E. Great job. You've passed the test. There's a few areas where you could improve. Oh but yeah! That was a solid performance. <laughs> well, at least I did. So, uh, at least I did a uh, toga, or at least uh, a go around, not a toga, but you know what I mean. One max speed. It got got to be, got to be. Allows you to navigate when you cannot see using visuals. Let's have a look at. Uh, Specializations, we now got eight unlocked. Let's see. We skipped earlier advertising, didn't we? But we've now got uh, search and rescue. Charter transit. Uh, charter service, private. So those are two new ones. All of these need extra levels apart from anything else. So I guess the next things for me to do, I pick up aerial advertising and charter service as uh, specializations. Let's have a look where they are, shall we? Charter service is over the islands. Is that Kiribati? I'm not sure. I'm not sort of bad. It's, it's the, uh, the islands over there. Live mission unlocked. Real weather conditions. You now have access to real condition missions. These allow you to scroll back up to 24 hours to fly in real-world weather conditions over the past day. Ooh. So I can scroll, use uh, menu, scroll left, menu, scroll right. What a menu scroll. Not sure. What is menu scroll left? Oh, I can change time there. I don't quite get... Oh, hang on, I can do that, can I? B? Can't even read what that is. But what if I don't want to do that right now? That doesn't make sense. I'll look that up off channel anyway. I'll see you next time.